exploring the holy habit of prayer, it's important to remember that this is a habit that needs to be practised, as Luke says, day by day. Sometimes prayer comes as easily as breathing, other days it's a struggle. Prayer is particularly important because it's a focused activity in which we draw near to the heart of God, in which we allow ourselves to be still and to know that God is God, to be renewed by God's Spirit, to be guided, to be energised in order to be faithful followers of Jesus. We know how important the holy habit of prayer is and how important it is to develop that habit from an early age. And this is my prayer, my hope for tomorrow, that we'll be as one, united forever, and live as He. At Trinity Learning, we go into the schools and provide quiet spaces for pupils and staff. Walk where he walked and stand as he stood. And this I promise you, if you walk in the path of righteousness, your life will be full of his love. We've provided prayer gardens for several schools, providing quiet areas where the children can sit, enjoy the stillness, enjoy nature. There are so many ways in which we can practice and apply this habit. Our daily prayer times, our personal prayer times are, of course, vital. A number of churches, for example, are going out into the community, distributing cards and inviting people to send those cards back to the church so that they can be prayed for. We're going through a major redevelopment at the moment. We've literally lost our place in the community. We came to the realisation that in order to refine our purpose and mission in the community, we needed to pray. has helped us to connect with the felt needs of our community, has given us a new enthusiasm for praying for our community. And as we get deeper into it, we find that we are cultivating and developing in our own life the holy habit of prayer. So practicing prayer day by day is so important. It draws us to the heart of God in prayer we're filled with the Spirit, in prayer we draw near to Jesus. It renews and energises us for all that he calls us to be and to do. It is as vital as the air that we breathe.